Hello everyone! Today, I prepared this beautiful shiny sparkly clay for crafting. We're going to make an outfit for Princess Ariel. I've also prepared for today's video! And you look great, Sammy! Look at this stuff! Isn't it neat? Is it a stencil for our princess's crown? Let's see if I rolled out the clay circle big enough for it. It fits! Now we need to carefully cut it along the contour. We won't need this anymore. I wonder what Sammy is doing there. Well, 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 what do we have here? Wow, now my collection is definitely complete. Oh, I need to pick up that chest. Where is my bag? What is this? Oh, it's glitter. Just what we need. What? Already stolen? But I stepped away for just a sec. How shimmery. It's just what we need for our crown. Hey, friends, don't forget to give a like to this video. Especially if you love pink as much as we do. Okay, what crystal should we choose? These, maybe? Yes, it looks great! But here, we need sparkles of a different color! Oops, this is all I had. What should I do now? What a cool comb! I combed out all the tangles! What? Sammy, do you happen to have any more crystals or gems? One moment. Will these do? Yes, thank you very much! Oh, and what is this? Nah, I won't give it up for anything! And what if I gave you this shiny thing? Wow, take whatever you want. Just give me this lovely mirror. Deal. So, where did we leave off? Oh, yes! Here goes the crown of Sam's collection, right in the middle. Hmm, this crystal reminds me of something. Oh, right! I've got just the ones we need. Amazing! Let's exchange again. I have a whole bunch of pearls here. Sorry, Sammy, but I don't think I have anything to give you in return. Well, for such beauty, nothing is a pity. Just take them. Seriously? It's very nice of you. Let's add more crystals to our crown then. I have something special to spruce up all that pink. Look how it shines, friends. Isn't it just magical? And next, we'll deal with shoes. This is the perfect size for Ariel. Or maybe I can become a shoe myself. Ooh, I like it here. Get out of there. I won't make a shoe out of slime. Why not? Let me go back. I can be a shoe. I was born for this. No, Sammy. I already have this shiny pink clay. This way, Ariel's shoes will match her crown. First, we need to fill one half of the stencil, like this. Now, let's prepare the clay for the second part. Whoosh! And it goes straight in here, filling in our stencil. Wait! Don't start without me! Take that, you clay! Uh. Let's just attach the two parts together. Um, Sammy, what are you doing? Sorry, the thoughts of becoming a shoe won't leave me. I will go now. Okay, where were we? All right, we put it all together. We need to squeeze it tighter so that the shoe doesn't fall apart. Let's also add more clay to fill the whole thing up. Now we need to be careful not to break anything, and voila! Wow, it's so beautiful! I wouldn't mind to have one myself. But I want to make it even more beautiful. Glitter makes everything better, and shoes are no exception. Hey, I want to do that too! Oh, who else is here working with glitter? Defend yourself! <clears throat> <laughs> okay, okay, Sammy, you win. Let's finish it together. Wow, it looks absolutely amazing. Be sure to add rhinestones that match the decor of the crown. Now we need something that will make these shoes stand out from all the others. Hmm, there's nothing in there. Maybe Sam has something? Bows. Yes, I think this could work. This color is definitely not right. It looks too simple. What about this one? No, I don't like it. Huh? Oh no, I'm blind! Huh, Sue, help me! Calm down, Sammy, it's just a bow. Like the one on your head, which is extremely beautiful. Wow, this is exactly what I was looking for. Now we can say for sure that this shoe belongs to the princess. Now we can finally get to work on the dress. And we'll make it out of clay, too. In a dress like this, 
Even I'm ready for a ball. No, for a coronation. Wait until I finish it and you'll be absolutely delighted. Okay, we don't need this anymore. Now let's take clay of a different color. This one especially caught my attention. We use it to make the bodice an overskirt. I'll try to fit both stencils on one piece, like this. Hey, it's my turn to cut. Carefully, carefully, almost there. All done. Great job, Sammy. Let's see if everything fits here. Perfect! Now, the last pattern, and we can move on to the second step. Painting. Where are our sparkles? Oh, it's over. Fear not, Lady Sue. I have everything covered. Unicorn ray of cuteness, go ahead! Wow, thanks, Unicorn. And thank you, Sir Samuel. For these parts, we need a different shade of glitter. I already took care of this, too! Oh, just look how beautiful this color is. It will look cool with the glitter we used before. I remember for sure that Ariel had a frill on her dress. And on this side, too, of course. Step number three as many rhinestones and crystals as possible. We can also use them around the edges. I think it would be great to place rhinestones along the outline of the overskirt. Oh, I have so many ideas for more decor. It's good that Sam gave us his treasure chest. These will look great on sleeves. I'll also add some small ones. Isn't it cute? Phew. Decorating a royal dress is not as easy as it seems. Let me help you! I have just the right rhinestones in mind! Wow! It worked from the first attempt! I'm a genius! Thanks, Sammy. I just had time to relax and ready to keep going. Here, the pearls will make something like a necklace. We will add more rhinestones to the overskirt. Let it sparkle. And voila. What a beauty. A dress worthy of a true princess. It is so pretty. Let me try it on, please. Welcome, Ariel. Putting together your outfit was a lot of fun. And we like that you like it. <laughs> Friends, subscribe to our channel and see you in the next videos. Bye-bye.